Dancing, yeah, guys. We're 400 and counting. God bless everyone that has clicked on the subscribe button. It wouldn't have been possible without you guys. I'm really humbled, I'm really grateful to everyone that has shared, to everyone that has commented, to everyone that God bless you guys. God bless you guys. Seriously, um, this channel will keep growing in Jesus' name, <laughs> amen. So today i want to talk about the pros and the cons of teesside teesside and middlesbrough so teesside and middlesbrough are together like you can't take anyone out because middles teesside is in middlesbrough yeah what am i even saying <laughs> okay so let's get down why teesside <clears throat> so i just want to share why i picked teesside and then the pros and the cons so the pros was way over over it was over the cons so that was why i picked it anyway so i just said let me because everywhere has its own advantages and disadvantages yeah everywhere has its own disadvantage and disadvantages so let's get down i'll be looking down because i had written down some things on my paper and i don't want to like miss it out so anytime you see my head going down it's because i'm trying to remember my points and get it straight i just hope that this content will be helpful to anyone that is watching and to anyone that's searching for information about studying so uk has like a lot of schools like wales scotland england like you have a lot of schools so i would say please do your research guys <coughs> do your research so when i was researching and a friend like that's the good thing when you know someone because some schools you might not even get to see them like when you are searching you might not even get to see them but they are out there but someone told me a friend a family friend that schools in Nottingham, so he's in newcastle is not far from i was like there's a school in middlesbrough i was like where's middlesbrough ah, for me i've never heard about it that was my first time of hearing of middlesbrough and he was like there's a school middlesbrough uh, in teesside in middlesbrough okay let's check it out and so when we checked it out wow well, <laughs> we started checking about the school and i was checking checking let me design and i didn't see fashion but when i went down down near the school now so like any design fashion this but then the main course is any design <clears throat> so the number one thing was there was no application fee generally in the uk when you're applying for schools in the uk there's no application fee so that the good thing is you can apply 10 schools 20 schools and then you get to sit down and pick the one you want that's the good thing about it i think i only applied three schools and i got admission in birmingham i got the other one was still asking me i'd already gotten the tea side when the i think head for share yeah, they were asking me for my portfolio and i just decided not to send the portfolio because i had already from my mind i already said i'm coming to this side so i just shunned them so guys you guys can get to pick and select what you want so the next one was no ielts now for some schools there are ielts like you have to do ielts but from schools you don't have to do ielts now for t side i didn't have to like if you have wayek you have miko that is if you're from nigeria west african examination so if you have wayek or you have nigeria examination results like you can just submit that they take it and all they need from that result is just the english if you have a credit in that result that is all you are good to go you don't have to stress yourself about spending 175k and so that time i was like ah, i don't want to spend 175k <laughs> for ielts so that was another plus and then scholarship now if you're an international student you get to have scholarship like a thousand five hundred to two thousand so if your score how they give the scholarship is if you have a two one you get two thousand scholarship if you have a two two you get one five scholarship so i was like discounting this from my payment for my school fees is a good thing 
why some schools like other schools still give scholarship but when i was weighing it because like birmingham birmingham city university when i read it was i think the school fees was like um eighteen thousand, and then they would say they are giving you three thousand thousand discounts if inside that three thousand discount your school fees is now 15k and then t said it was now and that's one year's program like the program is not a two-year program it's a one-year program so i have to pay that fifteen thousand in one year so for me it was you know that was like that was why i just like i'm no i'm not going there i'm not going there then the other point is say like living expenses like this and um, now middlesbrough is a small city it's a small city it's not a city yet itself it's a town so it's a small town whereby everything is very cheap especially accommodation like accommodation is very cheap compared to other places so in this place you can get to have accommodation i've done a video about accommodation so you can get to have accommodation of 400 you can get to have even 350 there are flat like two bed for 350 if you get council houses people in my office that are here like they've been living here they get to live in council houses 300 self some of them are paying 300 you know but it's just that the council houses will take a long wait but then <clears throat> normal houses that you get through agents you can get 300 400 500 at most for two bed three bed when it gets to 500 that one is even three bed safe <laughs> you know but now because of the rush, so because of the rush some of the prices are really going up but then <laughs> i have a friend that lives very close to london he says his rent is 1002 for two bed you can imagine and then their bills is like 300 and then here you get bills like some people have even some of my classmates are paying bills of 80 90 mine is 133 some people are even paying the highest you can get people paying bills here 150 then when you compare when you when you join like my rent is 475 with my bills 133 that's like 603 which makes a whole lot of sense so you need to sit down and do your research and check your pocket what are the things that that is most important to you so for me all these things i had to put them up like school where the school so it's, it's not okay to go to a cheap school but it's in an expensive town you know so it's not balancing but when you go to a cheap school and it's in a cheap town like you get to save a lot because that my friend was like whoa let's finish that one is even on a tier two visa i was like ah, if they finish your contract that they have to come and look for how they will come back to this cheap town so that they can be saving money you know so you can come to a small place and just start small save a lot you can just get to save a lot i moved to a bigger city which makes a lot of sense anyway then two years masters that was really <laughs> these two years masters <clears throat> so i was even attracted to it a lot when i saw that it was a two years masters because all the ones i've been applying like i've been applying for like <clears throat> A long time and then i've been seeing one year one year one year one year when i saw these two years and the person told me actually the person that told us about the school said it was a two years program ah i jumped into it because you get to have two years you know your visa gets to be two years you now apply for another postgrad that's another two years that's four years but if you do one year but it depends this i'm telling you is just on my own what i feel is a plus for me i'm not saying it's general to everybody because my apartment i was living there's someone that says he prefers a one-year course and he's here he opted for the one year because almost every course has one year two years so you choose which one do you want and he went for the one year because he just said he just wants to get it done and forgotten with which makes sense to him but for me i wanted two years and because my course is a practical course i wanted the second year another thing is the placement so I was also attracted to it because of the place you get to have industry like hands-on experience which is very good to anybody that is doing business to anybody that is doing production to anybody that is like you get to have hands-on experience from experts in the industry which is also very very good so and then guys this is not a sponsored video this is not a sponsored like I'm not working for T-Side. I'm just sharing this information to anyone that is looking for information out there. And please, guys, at this point, 
if you've not clicked the subscribe button if you like this content please you can click the subscribe button <laughs> thank you so let's get down on the video and then again payment plan like <laughs> payment plan you know this payment plan is the juiciest of all it's the best of all <laughs> so get to have this payment plan that makes sense that if it, if it, if it makes sense that i've done a video about the payment plan if you've not watched it please try and watch that video guys the payment plan makes sense that like i've not seen a payment plan like that i haven't seen a payment plan like that so there's this girl i saw her video on youtube she said her school fees is about fourteen thousand and then you get to pay four thousand before you come to school and then when you come to school that's when you get to pay four thousand and come to uh, for your deposit and then when you come to school you get to pay about about ten thousand now that ten thousand is split into into five installments and so every month you are paying two thousand <laughs> When you come UK, when you find work, when you want to start to pay to two thousand every month, that's crazy. I pay two hundred and eighty something every month, like two hundred and eighty something. See, her own is ten times more than my own. To her, is even okay, but maybe because she has not even heard about my own school. Maybe <laughs> you see that's why I keep saying do your research. Do your research, guys because for her it was okay because she said other schools she researched and she saw that immediately you resume you pay the lump sum like if it's ten thousand balance you pay everything before you start school actually that's how some schools are you pay the lump sum so but when she saw that she could pay ten thousand in five months like you get to split it she felt it was okay and so she went for that i was like wow this is really high this is really high so guys please check check that payment plan it makes sense check payment plan very well then again it's a pretty safe environment to live i know there's no place that doesn't have crime you get a little crimes here and there but it's not huge guys it's not huge compared to where i'm coming from <laughs> the crime rate is very low like very very low when you hear maybe they stole something somewhere or like nobody's coming to your door to attack you nobody's seeing you moving on the way to attack you except maybe i don't know if you work in dark places very late at night maybe someone can just brush you or maybe try to snatch something from you i think those are just minimal crimes very minimal crimes it's not like you'll be hearing gunshots or someone coming to attack you, someone coming to kidnap you. Because where I'm coming from, those are the kind of stories. So that's the way we live there. So coming here, guys, I traveled from from London to Middlesbrough on a bus and I slept. Like, <laughs> I slept like a baby without being scared or being attacked on the road. This place is pretty safe. We are coming from a harder place, so it's safe guys it's really really safe so for me that was another plus so check all the boxes and the next video i'm going to make is going to be about the cons of teesside and Middlesbrough because a lot of people have dm me have talked about cars i know i've done a video about cars but the next video the little information i have that i'm going to share it with you guys and i hope that this video has been really helpful to everyone anyone that is out there searching for information thank you guys for watching and see you back next time bye bye <music>